Hey guys, how's it going? Good afternoon. I got a little home studio that I have set up right now. Um, and I thought that this would be a better audio capture than um, 
talking into the MacBook. So hopefully this will be better. Um, I said that I was going to be doing vlogs, but um, I had some stuff come up. So I wanted to kind of update you guys on some things. Number one, I just want to say thank you for everyone who does watch these. My goals for 2015 were aimed towards two major things, which was to lengthen the duration of my live set and to work on writing, recording, and releasing a new album. Uh, but as most of you have seen, if, if you're watching these vlogs or seen posts online, uh, the problems with my back um, are becoming extremely complicated and they're definitely taking a precedence to other things in my life right now. My idea for this next CD is to do seven songs, um, four of them with vocals and three of them instrumentals. I thought this was a, a good balance based off uh, the response of my previous album. And uh, as of right now, six of the seven songs are done. I thought doing like a six-month recap of the year might be a really good thing to do. So January, I had four shows in Illinois. I was also working like 40 plus hours a week. Um, and I had an hour commute each way, um, but I stopped working full time around February 6th and I also put a stop to all my guitar lessons. I stopped booking shows for a number of reasons. In February, I had one show in Illinois, but that's when the back problems started. Um, after spending five months or so working 40 plus hours um, at my most recent job, I used the available time in February to get my life back in order, clean up my apartment. Uh, <laughs> start working on these new songs. Um, my schedule previous to taking this break was a little go, go, go. So right now, well, I should say in February, um, it, it was nice to kind of relax for a little bit. Also with the back problem starting, uh, relaxing was almost something I had to do. I had no choice. So March, I had one show in Illinois again. Uh, this one was super painful because the back problems were happening more and more. Um, I took a trip to California to see a friend, to write music, etc., cetera, etc., cetera. Um, and this is when the problems uh, became tremendously worse. This is when I was on the ground for 13 days straight. Um, pain was just overwhelming. I couldn't really focus on anything at all. Writing didn't happen. Yeah, it was it was an interesting month to say the least. Uh, April, I had two shows in Illinois. Both were super, super painful. Um, tried to do more writing, but this is when I started doing lots of physical therapy and just resting a lot. So April was really just doctor appointments and kind of, you know, just putting all my efforts uh, into trying to fix what's going on. May, um, I had another show, one show in Illinois. Um, it was still pretty painful to play. Um, I did a, a cameo with Rob Scallon that month for the Metallica battery cover. I took another trip to California. Uh, I went to Lake Tahoe, Nevada, also to my sister's wedding. With the state of my back, I wasn't going to bring a guitar on this trip. I was just like, I can't lug this thing around. It's going to be just insane. And I went 26 days without a guitar. And it sucked. It sucked a lot. A lot of writing could have been done with the guitar, but a lot of things were still done for the CD within that month of May. I still was able to work on a lot of goals um, pertaining to the music, but not the music itself, other than what I was writing in my head or journaling or something of the sort. So June, uh, no shows in June, uh, which is kind of crazy because I can't remember the last time where I didn't have any shows at all, um, but I didn't want to book anything. I just was like, nothing, I'm not booking anything this month. I had an MRI, I had doctor's appointments like crazy. I had more physical therapy. Um, I just took the time to rest. Honestly, June was nothing but resting. July, which was last month. You just saw a video from that show. Um, I started doing lessons again, doing more physical therapy, uh, more writing. So July was pretty good, you know, trying to get back into the swing of things. Feeling a little bit better, but definitely not 100% at all. Now we're in August. Uh, I played a show on August 1st, um, and it went okay. I, I tried a new song that was uh, definitely had my hand freaking out. And I don't know if it was the song or the nerve problems that I'm happening. I'm not too sure. Uh, recently, they have me on a few different medications trying to fix what's going on. But uh, I have to get another MRI done, which I haven't been able to schedule yet because I have to get another x-ray of the top portion of my body. There's a, there's a bunch of other stuff I have to do with my back, but I'm as you know and can see... <laughs> um, I'm doing everything I possibly can to fix that, you know. Despite being away from Illinois as much as I have been this year, and despite my ongoing physical problems, I'm still making progress towards my goal. And that is awesome. And I wouldn't be able to do that if you guys didn't continue supporting me. Please keep sharing links, and I'll put a ton of them in the description below. Um, 
you know, pick up a CD or a shirt or a beanie or whatever. I've got tons of merch online. I'd love to be able to give you some. I would love for you to be able to wear it around your town and show your friends. But every penny counts right now, probably more than it ever has. Every post you make about the music, every share you do, it helps tremendously. And I can't express that enough. I am extremely thankful and grateful for the time that you guys have put into this music. It's amazing. Seriously. I hope you'll continue to support this as I'm kind of pushing through to the next chapter, so to say. And I hope you'll stick around because it's going to be a lot of fun. So thank you for watching as always. I hope you enjoy the live footage. As I mentioned before, I'm probably going to be doing less and less vlogs as I'm putting more and more of my efforts and time into trying to work on this music. Stay tuned. Thanks for watching as always.